All right, all right, all right, everyone. Welcome back to another special episode of Itchy Hands. It is Friday, so you know what that means. It is Fat Cat Friday, and we have ten. Count them. One, two, three, four, six, nine, ten Fat Cats. And these were bought from a very special place, so I'll tell you about that in one second. But before we do the Fat Cat, I want to do this $30 card. Everybody's telling me, Itchy, the big winner is still out there on this $30 card. So, if the video gets cut short, you'll know why. It's because uh, we went up to $10 million. So, if we win $10 million today, the next video will be from uh, Fiji. Alright, guys. Like I said, I'm looking for that multiplier. That's really all I want now. I just want this multiplier. So, quick story today. Itchy Inge had to go to Staten Island today for work. And, um, for those of you who don't know, New York City is made up of five boroughs. Itchy Inge lives in Manhattan. Then there's Brooklyn, Queens, the Bronx, and finally Staten Island, which is connected to... Brooklyn from the Verrazano Narrows Bridge. Which should not actually be a borough. A lot of people don't like Staten Island, but I have a lot of viewers from Staten Island and a lot of subs from Staten Island. So we're not going to... I love Staten Island. I love everybody in it. But I do want to say, why is it called Staten Island? And the answer is simple. And this is a true story. When Christopher Columbus sailed the seven seas and came to this fine country we live in. He was looking at Staten Island, and he looked at it, and he looked to his friend Gary, and he said, Gary, is that an island? But his accent was so heavy. He has a heavy Italian accent, does Christopher Columbus. So Gary thought he was calling it Staten Island. And that's how the name stuck, Staten Island. That is a true story. That it is Staten Island? Staten Island? It is an island, Gary said. All right, enough of that. And it looks like it's going to be enough of this ticket. I'm not even paying attention. I was so into my story. Ah, I thought we had a winner. 33, we have 23. 26, 28, 36, 6, 1. 19, 38, 8, 9, 15. That's no good. 13. 21, 17, 12, 32, 18, 32. All right, enough of this. Let's get into the Fat Cat. It's Fat Cat Friday, so we have 10. Count them. 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 9, 10. Number 11 through 20. We'll start from number 11. Uh, if I miss anything, just let me know. Um, just want to thank everyone for watching. Up oh, 2 and Jardine. Uh... I love all you guys, 16 and 18, we need 26 and 6. Alright, that's the first loser of the Fat Cats, folks. Um, it is a kind of muggy day here in New York today, so if it's a little darker than normal, 9 and 20. Let's see if Fat Cat, can, Fat Cat Friday could produce some winners here, and by some miracle, a profit session. You know what, I'll take a $2 win now, to be honest with you. This is 9 and 20. This is no good either. All right, ticket number 13. Everybody knows that ticket number 13 is the big winner because cats have 13 lives and 21 and 28. Let's see here. 18 we got. 21 and 28. No good. So the first three down, Smelly. What you doing? We need your help here. We need you to root us in. We have no winners yet. No winners. 28 and 12. Meow. Oh, for Pete's sake. Let me tell you something. Who is this Pete? I don't know. And what's his sake? What's his sake, this Pete? Look at that fat cat. Look at that fat cat. That fat cat. All right. 13 and 29. Maybe we'll get a card full of fat cat symbols. Fourteen and twenty. We do have a house full of fat cats. Now we need. I can actually show you one now. This is a this is a special sighting here. I'm going to try and show you Uncle Grissom. Bebop. Oh, Bebop. Oh, Bebop. And we got a gigantic Roger over here. Come here, Roger. Oh, Bebop. Roger. Oh, look at Bebop. There's a Roger. Look at Roger. How big he is. Oh, look at Roger. 
Friday. All right, enough of that. It's Fat Cat Friday. Who are we fooling here? Yeah. Meow. All right, so this is another loser, I think. So we're up to number six. So the first one, two, three, four tickets are losers. Of course they are, Richie. It's Fat Cat. This one's bent, and Jardine is a number. So maybe there's 23 in Jardine. Yeah, that's a loser. That's right. Everybody knows a fat cat holds holds all their winners, so they could beat up top dog, beat up on top dog. But I have a feeling top dog is going to win tomorrow. Marshall and Mo Marshall and Mo definitely rooting for top dog tomorrow. Ah, oh, we got a hanger, folks. Yeah. Double hanger on Fat Cat Friday, two dollars and two dollars. All right, we got something back. We got our first win on Fat Cat Friday, a four dollar win. One and twenty-one. There's eleven. Of course, there's eleven. All right, two more, folks. Could it be? Uh, and I tell you, I I purposely didn't buy these from Creepy Bobby. I got them from Staten Island. 19 and 24, and it doesn't look like doesn't look like the Staten Island tickets are much better. I'm going to be honest with you. So out of all of these tickets, we got back four dollars. Unless this one, 18 and four, we need. No good. All right. So, Fat Cat Friday, folks. Don't mind the the scratch ticket shavings here. I think they call them shavings. Uh, who knows? My father always told me they were poison. Um, we have a $4 winner, folks. So on $20 worth of Fat Cats, we got back $4. That is what you call not very good. But Itchy Ange has been on a bad schneid with the tickets, so I'll take the $4 because we could have got nothing. There's the sword. Um, I hope you guys uh, enjoyed this video. I hope you guys enjoyed looking at Uncle Grissom and Roger. Smelly Michelle's feet. The boyfriend's in the in the shower. He has a new name. It's Schnarfical. So Schnarfical will be referred to now from the boyfriend. Schnarfical's in the shower. Jonesy's working. And uh, and that is it. So uh, we are signing off here. Another episode of Itchy Ange. Thank you so much for watching. Fat Cat Friday. Tomorrow we will be back. We will be back with... Fat Cat vs. Top Dog, the Saturday Slugfest. I can't wait. It's going to be a video of epic proportions. And we will see you next time.